Today, our 2015 Chrysler Town & Country, we will be test running the Swagman Trailhead Tilting 4 Bike Rack. That's part number S63380. Uh, this bike rack can be used for either inch and a quarter or two inch hitches. We've got our adapter here for our two inch hitch. We go ahead and begin by inserting our shank into our receiver. Next thing we want to do is line up our pinholes. Once we get that lined up, we'll go ahead and take our included anti-rattle bolt and thread that through. And we'll take our socket wrench and tighten that the rest of the way down. The nice thing about this anti-rattle bolt is going to help reduce the play in the rattle within our hitch and our bike rack. So we'll put my clip in place and then we'll take a few measurements. Starting with our nearest point, it's going to be right here to our bumper, about two and a half inches away. Overall, we've added about 21 and a half inches to our vehicle. And for our ground clearance, about 16 inches right here. All right, since so bike rack has a tilt feature, we'll go ahead and show you that. What you want to do is you want to come back around here. We'll loosen our knob up here. We'll turn this vertical, and then we'll remove our pin and clip. By doing that, you can see it allows us to tilt our bike rack out. It'd be a good time to get into our rear hatch, remove any cargo, gear, groceries, whatever we might have with us on our trip. All right, so to put that back in place, we'll raise it up, put our, our pin in place, put our clip on, then we'll come down here. It was vertical, we'll turn it horizontal. What this does is it acts as a, a tightening mechanism for our center mast. It just kind of helps tighten things up. We'll make sure that's nice and tight. Then we can come up here to our cradle arms, remove our pin and clip up top. We'll raise it up, align our pin holes. Put our clip in place. By raising those arms up, we've added about 34 inches to our vehicle. Now we can undo our straps to get ready for our bike. All right, once we get our bike positioned where we want it, we want it at least snug up to our center tube up here with at least one of our mounts. So we'll bring our strap around. This is gonna be our anti-sway strap. That's gonna help reduce the sway in our bike while we're driving down the road. So we'll finish up with our other three straps to get our bike nice and secure on our bike rack. All right, and then our bike is secure and ready to hit the road. That's going to complete our test fit of the Swagman Trailhead Tilting 4 Bike Rack, part number S63380 on our 2015 Chrysler Town & Country. Let's see how that bike rack did on our test course. 